The Su-57, Russia's fifth-generation fighter jet, stands as the most advanced aircraft in the nation's military aviation arsenal, combining stealth, maneuverability, and an array of sophisticated weapon systems to redefine modern aerial warfare. Initially conceived during the Soviet era, the fighter was part of a program aimed at maintaining technological parity with emerging Western fifth-generation designs. The collapse of the Soviet Union in the early 1990s delayed its development, but by the early 2000s, Russia resumed the project with renewed focus, eventually leading to the T-50 prototype. In 2017, the aircraft officially received the designation Su-57, marking its formal induction into the Russian Air Force's modernization programs. This aircraft is intended not only to replace aging MiG-29 and Su-27 jets but also to serve as a multi-role platform capable of executing both air superiority missions and precision ground attacks. The Su-57 is a single-seat fighter with a cockpit significantly wider than that of the Su-27, reflecting both ergonomic advancements and accommodation for advanced avionics. The cockpit layout features multiple multifunctional displays, including two large 15-inch screens and supplementary instruments for flight and combat data. A wide-angle collimator system provides rapid targeting information, while helmet-mounted displays project critical data directly onto the pilot's visor. These integrated systems allow the pilot to maintain situational awareness without diverting attention from the external environment. The cockpit canopy itself is designed with radar-absorbing coatings, reducing the aircraft's visibility to enemy radar by approximately 30%. This attention to both pilot comfort and stealth functionality underscores the Su-57's dual emphasis on human performance and survivability in high-threat environments. Aerodynamically, the Su-57 employs an integrated airframe design featuring a high-set trapezoidal wing that merges seamlessly with a wide fuselage, optimizing both lift and stealth characteristics. The tail section includes all moving stabilizers and canted vertical fins, which minimize radar signature while enhancing maneuverability. The wing features complex mechanisms, including leading edge extensions and flaperons, designed to provide exceptional control at high angles of attack. The control surface's actuation systems are recessed under the wings in streamlined pods to maintain the aircraft's low observability. In addition, the airframe incorporates extensive use of composite materials, which constitute approximately 25% of the aircraft's weight and nearly 70% of its surface area. This reduces overall mass, simplifies production, and allows for more efficient structural fabrication compared to earlier generation aircraft. The use of composite materials also contributes to lightning protection and resilience, ensuring operational safety in diverse weather conditions. The Su-57 stealth capabilities extend beyond its airframe shape and materials. The aircraft is equipped with advanced electronic warfare systems, including the L-402 Himalaya Defensive Suite, designed to operate across multiple frequencies in coordination with the onboard radar and sensor systems. The aircraft also features a multi-band radar suite, incorporating both active and passive electronically scanned arrays distributed across the fuselage and wings. The main radar, designated N036 Belka, includes five separate AESA antennas operating in both X and L bands, allowing for detection of low-observable aircraft and tracking of multiple aerial targets simultaneously. The N036 radar is complemented by the Optical Locational System OLS-50M, providing infrared and television range detection capabilities. This system ensures that the Su-57 can maintain situational awareness even in environments with heavy electronic countermeasures, allowing the pilot to engage targets while remaining largely undetectable. Power is provided by two AL-41F1 engines, known as Product 30 in their upgraded configuration, which represent a significant evolution over the previous generation of AL-31-based powerplants. 
These engines are designed to produce a maximum thrust of 16 tons, providing the Su-57 with supersonic speeds exceeding 2,600 km per hour and a service ceiling of 20,000 meters. The engines feature adjustable sub-fuselage air intakes to optimize airflow and reduce radar cross-section. The integration of these advanced power plants allows for supermaneuverability, including high-angle of attack flight and rapid acceleration, which are crucial in dogfight scenarios. Additionally, the engine's design incorporates stealth considerations, including reduced infrared signatures and optimized exhaust shaping to minimize detection by heat-seeking systems. The Su-57 is not only a high-speed interceptor but also a versatile strike platform. Its internal weapons bays are designed to carry a wide array of armaments, maintaining low observability while providing substantial combat payload. Internally, the fighter can accommodate up to 10,000 kg of ordnance, including a mix of air-to-air -air missiles such as the R-77 and its advanced variant, the K-77 meter. The K-77 meter is capable of engaging high-maneuverability targets with low radar cross-sections at ranges up to 190 km, featuring a sophisticated guidance system that can operate effectively even under heavy electronic interference. For ground attack roles, the Su-57 can deploy precision-guided munitions including the KH-38 Mi, anti-radar missiles like the KH-58 USHKE, and the advanced KH-59 MK-2 cruise missile. This latter system is capable of terrain-following flight at long ranges, allowing it to strike targets up to 300 kilometers away with high precision. The aircraft's standard loadout typically includes a combination of eight medium-range air-to-air missiles and two short-range missiles, alongside multiple guided bombs such as the KAB-500 series, enabling both defensive and offensive flexibility in combat operations. In addition to internal bays, the Su-57 has provisions for external weapon mounts, although these are primarily used in scenarios where stealth is less critical. This capability enables the aircraft to carry larger or specialized munitions for strategic missions. The Su-57 also features an onboard 30mm 9A1-4071 K cannon, installed in the right-wing route, capable of delivering high rates of fire with exceptional accuracy. This weapon complements the missile arsenal, providing close-range combat capability in scenarios where missile engagement is impractical or unnecessary. The combination of stealth, advanced radar and sensor systems, high-speed engines, and diverse armament makes the Su-57 one of the most formidable platforms for modern aerial warfare. Low observability is a cornerstone of the Su-57's design philosophy. Its radar signature has been minimized through shaping, careful material selection, and radar absorbent coatings applied to critical surfaces. Edges of wings and fuselage elements are angled to deflect radar waves, while surfaces avoid orthogonal intersections that could act as corner reflectors. Internal weapons bays further reduce radar returns by housing ordnance within the fuselage. Visual stealth is achieved through specialized camouflage paint schemes, including deforming patterns that disrupt the aircraft's silhouette. The infrared and acoustic signatures are controlled through engine placement, exhaust shaping, and heat management systems, reducing detection by both infrared sensors and acoustic monitoring. Passive sensors and data links allow the Su-57 to gather information on adversaries while remaining covert, further enhancing survivability in contested environments. Structurally, the Su-57's landing gear mirrors the conventional tricycle arrangement, with a wide track enabled by the broad fuselage. The nose gear consists of dual wheels with anti-skid braking and mudguards, while the main gear features single wheels with integrated brakes. All landing gear retract along the direction of flight, and the wheel wells are carefully covered to maintain aerodynamic and stealth performance. The aircraft's control surfaces are electrically actuated, allowing precise manipulation during complex maneuvers, 
while also contributing to the overall stealth profile by reducing mechanical linkages and protrusions. The Su-57's airframe integrates features that improve agility and combat effectiveness. Leading edge extensions and all moving tailplanes enhance lift and control at high angles of attack. The fuselage and wing geometry are optimized not only for aerodynamics but also for low radar observability. The aircraft's integral structure, including wide fuselage and blended wing design, maximizes lift and reduces drag while minimizing radar returns. Small auxiliary inlets along the tail section provide cooling for avionics and other onboard systems, demonstrating the careful balance of stealth, performance, and operational reliability in the aircraft's design. The radar and sensor integration on the Su-57 is revolutionary for Russian aircraft. The N-036 radar, with its multiple AESA arrays, allows detection and engagement of multiple targets simultaneously, including low observable aircraft that might evade earlier radar systems. The OLS-50M optical locational system provides full-spectrum surveillance, including infrared and visual detection, while the L-402 electronic warfare suite offers active and passive countermeasures. These systems work in concert, feeding data to an integrated avionics network that allows the pilot to make informed tactical decisions with minimal exposure to enemy detection. The ability to detect threats, target adversaries, and deploy countermeasures in a stealthy manner is a defining feature of the Su-57, giving it a strategic advantage in both air-to-air -air and air-to-ground missions. The aircraft's engines, while providing substantial thrust, also play a role in stealth. The AL-41F1 engines are designed with reduced infrared emissions and optimized nozzle geometry to minimize detection by heat-seeking systems. The Engine's air intakes can adjust their geometry during flight to optimize airflow, maintaining performance at both subsonic and supersonic speeds while limiting radar visibility. These engines also support supermaneuverability, enabling the aircraft to execute high-alpha maneuvers and rapid acceleration that are critical in air combat scenarios. This combination of stealth, speed, and agility ensures that the Su-57 can both evade detection and dominate engagements in contested airspace. Operationally, the Su-57 is capable of engaging multiple target types across different combat scenarios. Its air-to-air -air missiles provide layered defensive and offensive options, while precision-guided bombs and air-to-surface missiles enable strategic strikes against ground targets. The internal weapons bays preserve stealth during engagements, and external stores allow additional payload capacity when required. The aircraft's sensors and electronic warfare systems complement its armament, ensuring target acquisition and threat mitigation in complex environments. The integrated design philosophy of the Su-57, combining stealth, speed, sensor fusion, and weapons versatility, positions it as one of the most advanced multi-role fighters in contemporary military aviation. The Su-57 is also designed with production efficiency and maintainability in mind. The use of composite materials reduces part counts and simplifies assembly, resulting in faster manufacturing cycles and lower costs relative to previous generation aircraft. Modular avionics and sensor systems allow for upgrades without extensive airframe modifications, ensuring that the platform remains relevant as technology evolves. The aircraft's operational concepts include both conventional air superiority roles and multi-role strike missions, demonstrating flexibility in deployment across various theaters of operation. This forward-looking approach ensures that the Su-57 will remain a cornerstone of Russia's air combat capabilities for decades to come. Stealth, sensor fusion, advanced propulsion, and multi-role armament are the defining features of the Su-57, enabling it to perform in a variety of mission profiles with exceptional effectiveness. Its combination of aerodynamics, low observability, and integrated electronic systems represents a significant leap forward compared to previous Russian fighters. 
The aircraft's ability to operate in contested environments, engage multiple target types, and maintain situational awareness while minimizing detection makes it a formidable platform for both defensive and offensive operations. With ongoing development and integration of new missile systems, avionics, and electronic warfare capabilities, the Su-57 embodies the next generation of Russian fighter design philosophy, balancing performance, survivability, and operational flexibility in an increasingly complex aerial battlefield. The aircraft's combat capabilities are further enhanced by the range of munitions it can employ. Air-to-air -air engagements are supported by medium-range and long-range missiles capable of intercepting highly maneuverable targets, while air-to-surface operations can utilize precision-guided munitions, anti-radar weapons, and long-range cruise missiles. The internal weapons bays are designed for stealth, but external mounts allow additional ordnance when stealth is not a priority. This adaptability ensures that the Su-57 can respond effectively to a wide range of threats, from conventional fighter aircraft to strategic ground targets, without compromising survivability or mission effectiveness. In conclusion, the Su-57 represents a comprehensive evolution in Russian fighter design, integrating stealth, supermaneuverability, advanced avionics, and versatile weapon systems into a single platform. Its design philosophy emphasizes both survivability and lethality, leveraging cutting-edge materials, propulsion technology, and sensor integration to achieve air superiority in modern combat environments. From its inception in the Soviet era to its current operational status, the Su-57 exemplifies Russia's commitment to maintaining a competitive edge in fifth-generation fighter technology. Its combination of advanced features ensures that it will play a central role in future aerial conflicts, demonstrating the strategic value of integrating stealth, speed, and firepower into a cohesive combat aircraft platform. The Su-57 not only represents the pinnacle of current Russian aviation technology but also establishes a foundation for future innovations in fighter design, shaping the trajectory of air combat capabilities for decades to come.